Tesla price cuts are impacting the entire auto industry. Tesla has ignited a price war in the auto industry. So far, it's Ford who has been forced to follow suit. Rivian and Lucid Group are laying people off, and suppliers are bracing for givebacks. We think there's a lot more to come, and we also believe ICE manufacturers will be pushed to pony up some discounts too. Hi, I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homer Guy, here today with the amazing Elizabeth, the Homer Gal. Whether you like Elon Musk or not, doesn't matter. Whether you like EVs or not, also doesn't matter. Whether you believe Elon Musk's price cuts still leave his EVs too expensive also doesn't matter. What you should definitely take away from this news is that the auto industry is facing serious trouble and CEOs like Elon Musk are making that fact public information. Yeah. We've made several predictions for where the car market is headed with all of it nosing down and Tesla taking the lead on dropping prices only serves to pour gas on the falling <laughs> car market. Good. It's almost ironic that an EV maker could pour gas on a falling car market. Right. Tesla suppliers heard recent comments made by Tesla Chief Financial Officer Zach Kirkhorn saying that the automaker was attacking every other area of cost, including the supply chain, and started freaking out. We knew that would come. Remember when we reported the Tesla price drops, we said this would force other automakers to follow suit? Well, that's happening. That's precisely what's going on as Ford Motor is increasing production and cutting prices of its electric Mustang Mach-E crossover weeks after industry leader Tesla announced similar plans for its EVs. Ford announced that they were cutting prices on the Mach-E Mustang with cuts ranging from 600 to 5,900 bucks depending on the model. Yeah. You see that? The cuts of one company leads to cuts from another. Ford executives are actually saying these cuts mean the company will lose money on some of the Mach-E models. Aww. In addition to moves by Ford, EV startup Rivian and Lucid Group are cutting back on staff. Lucid Group is going to half staff with Rivian Automotive laying off 6% of its workforce in its effort to cut costs as the EV makers already grappling with falling cash reserves and a weak economy braced for an industry-wide price war. As we said in our previous show on Tesla, it matters not whether you like Elon Musk or not. You have to love the implications of price cuts to the entire auto industry. This war is bad for manufacturers and dealers, but great for every car buyer out there. So in the wake of Tesla price cuts, Tesla suppliers are bracing for pressure from chief executive Elon Musk and his team to cut their parts prices further after the EV maker aggressively slashed vehicle prices in a slowing economy, said industry officials who work with the automaker and its suppliers. The suppliers saw a ominous dark cloud after comments by Tesla chief financial officer Zach Kirkhorn that the automaker was attacking every area of cost, including the supply chain, and would work closely with suppliers. During Tesla's earnings conference call last week, Musk said a recession could lead to meaningful decreases in almost all of its input costs. Dan Sharkey, an attorney who represents suppliers to Tesla and other automakers, said, it is never good for suppliers when automakers cut vehicle prices because that pressure rolls downhill like it should. He didn't say that part. I did. <laughs> I never like it, says Dan, because I know eventually they're going to try to get it out of one of us. He added, my message is, there's not going to be any room here. Many suppliers are struggling financially. Most Tesla suppliers, including battery makers, Panasonic LG Energy Solution and CATL, as well as Italian casting machine maker IDRA Group, avoid discussing the car maker publicly due to confidentiality agreements. Tesla's cost reduction efforts come after it aggressively cut vehicle prices last month, prompting U.S. rival Ford Motor Company to follow suit. That threatens to erode Tesla's profit margins, the largest in the industry. While the resulting pressure on suppliers to cut their prices is not a new type of strategy, one executive at a Tesla supplier who asked not to be identified said, the EV leader during the COVID-19 pandemic had focused more on delivery over pricing and was willing to even pay more to get parts faster. He worries the comments on last month's earning conference call signal changes are coming. Tesla did not respond to requests for further comment on its suppliers while Tesla and other automakers enjoyed higher vehicle prices and strong margins during the pandemic. Suppliers were not able to fully pass along higher costs and their margins fell, according to a study by consultancy Bain. Automakers' profit margins were nearly three percentage points higher than suppliers in the third quarter of last year. More price cuts could be painful in a sector where some suppliers are already struggling, officials said. For example, Gissing North America, which had counted Tesla as its biggest customer, filed for bankruptcy last year, partly due to high labor costs and commodity pricing, said Stephen Weibel, chief restructuring officer of the Michigan-based maker of acoustic systems and headliners for car ceilings. 
He said, there's certain things that I think will ease, but this labor component that's built into the price of everything, and I don't see that easing anytime soon and potentially never. Sharky, the supplier attorney, warned all of the... <laughs> Sharky's a great name for That's him. great, yeah. He says, all of these suppliers are not charities. They need to make money, and if they lose money, then they're in financial distress. Ah, uh, poor Sharky. Industry officials said Musk might actually seek to reassure suppliers that any potential losses they suffer in lower pricing will be made up in higher volume. Nevertheless, some suppliers are increasing prices due to material cost inflation. Along those lines, NXP Semiconductors said on Tuesday it is increasing the prices it charges customers, citing higher input costs of their own. NXP has not disclosed it is a Tesla supplier, but analysts said a teardown of Tesla vehicles shows that to be the case. NXP CEO Kurt Sievers told Reuters, Honestly, we don't have a lot of pushback from the car companies. Tesla could negotiate cost reductions with suppliers through shared efficiencies or by simply twisting the supplier's arm and taking some of their profit away, a former Tesla executive told Reuters. Tesla will now be doing what every other automaker has been doing for decades. Tesla will face resistance, industry officials warn. Another industry consultant, Lori Harbour, who works with suppliers, said, they will get a lot of pushback from suppliers to cut costs. Pushback and resistance, perhaps, but my money is on Elon winning this battle. Yeah. A special thanks to Automotive News for their excellent coverage of this story. If you'd like to show us some love for producing quality car market updates and accurate car buying advice videos like this one, the links for tips appearing on the screen will be easy to find in the description box down below. PayPal, Cash App, and Venmo. And there's also the Super Thanks button down below the video. To be clear, we're not begging anyone for a tip, not even close. Our tip system was suggested to us by our viewing audience. Generous people ask for a way to donate to support our mission. But if a tip isn't an option for you right now, there's no need whatsoever for you to be a part of the donor crowd. Just show us some love by subscribing and recommending our videos to your family and friends. We thank you for that. I also want to remind our viewers that we'll provide free black book values for a vehicle you're shopping for or a vehicle you'd like to trade in. You can text us at 701-441-3399 or email us at kevinthehomeworkguy at gmail.com and you'll get an immediate auto response from the email with a roadmap to a successful car deal. If you're out walking the car lots right now, make sure you see Kevin's playlist, THG's Savvy Car Buyers Homework Cram Session. Join the thousands of people who have already done that. And if you happen to be on Facebook, drop by and give us a like and a follow. And don't forget to visit our website too, thehomeworkguy.com. It's loaded up with free resources for car buyers, and we now offer a blog post there too. All right, if you're new here at the Homework Guy channel, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell so you get the notifications. Yeah. Join the fast-growing group of subscribers and become a part of our family. Thanks, everyone, for coming back. And to all of our faithful subscribers out there, you guys rock. God bless you all. I'm Kevin Hunter, the Homework Guy, signing off with Amazing Elizabeth, the Homework Gal. The Homework Guy team is serving truth and justice in the car business. We, we gotta, gotta go. go.